Three months after being banished, Republican fabulist George Santos has returned to the Capitol in a dramatic fashion. During President Joe Biden's State of the Union address in the House, the Long Island liar made an unexpected appearance and talked to old colleagues. The expelled Republican member who used campaign cash for Botox and OnlyFans and falsified the majority of his CV still has access to House floor privileges. He arrived before the 81-year-old president's major speech, along with the other lawmakers. The woman who heckled Biden the previous year, Marjorie Taylor Greene, arrived sporting a t-shirt that said, Lakin Riley, say her name. Republicans are requesting that Biden make mention of the 22-year-old Georgia jogger who was killed in his speech. She was killed, and an illegal immigrant is being held for the crime. Numerous Democratic women attended the address dressed in white as a show of support for women's reproductive rights. The Long Island congressman was only the sixth House member in history to be removed in December after he stole donor funds and used them for Botox and OnlyFans. Santos was charged with 23 counts of wire fraud, money laundering, and forging federal records by the Department of Justice after shocking revelations surfaced, exposing that he had fabricated a significant portion of his resume and personal history. Santos has entered a not guilty plea to federal allegations that involve numerous complex fraud schemes, including the unlawful use of credit card details obtained through theft from political contributors. Santos has launched a successful career on Cameo by selling customized movies of himself after being fired.